Yo ho, what is up gamers, let's get right into it. Run 12 in Stony Field, I get my first TC87 item, which is Executioner's Justice. Run 76, a Thunder Charm drops. Turns out it's a perfect flame rift. At 96, I found another perfect Thunder, but this time it's a cold rupture. Run 97, wonderful small charm drops with 3 max, 15 AR, and 7 magic find. Close to perfect. Hundred nineteen in jail. I found Tarasha's armor. Pretty low defense, but hello there. Hundred seventy-five in City of Damned. One of these ghosts dropped the beautiful Istrum. At 213, a unique ring drops, which is a perfect turn magic find Nagel. Round 252, a set amulet drops, and I would not show it if it's not Tarasha's adjudication. What you're about to see made me so mad I can't even tell you. This base, in this shape, could worth around 7 or 8 baroons if it rolls to 0 or 4 sockets. Yeah, that one socket on it is a disaster. Three hundred nineteen In Frigid Highlands, I found an Arak out of a super unique. Three hundred and forty-two. A unique jewel drops, which is a cold facet. Five four die. Unlucky roll. Four hundred and forty-three. That sacred armor drops out of Diablo. Most of us knows this is Immortal Kings. At four hundred and sixty, a unique ring drops. A kind of rare one which has much more value in Hardcore, with Projector, close to anti-perfect. 487. In Travinsal, a unique GC drops, which is a Gee Charm. Perfect for a magic find on it. So the next drop is interesting. This rune cannot drop here by the Councils unless it's terrorized. You already know what it is then. A Zodrum. First time ever found it with 20,000 plus hours of gameplay. If you enjoyed the video, please consider to subscribing. Leave a like and a comment below. Also, I'm giving away the entire loot highlight without exception for one lucky player on my Discord. The participation is completely free. You can find the Discord invite in the description. Stay tuned, fellas, and stay safe. Thanks for watching as always. See you in the next one. Bye.